Yo, welcome to my YouTube channel. Here's my setup for shooting NFL games. Gravy. Thank you, Billy. Billy is golden. Hey, Billy right there. Nature boy, Rick. And yes, I rock two cameras on game day, so I don't have to waste time breaking one setup down to build the next setup. I can just drop one, pick up the other one, and grip it and rip it. All right, so for the gimbal setup, I'm rocking the DJI Ronin S, a Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K a Canon 16 to 35 millimeter, and if needed, a Tiffin variable ND filter when it's sunny. This is a great rig for player arrivals, warm-ups, the anthem, TD celebrations, and post-game handshakes. Basically, this is my go-to setup for pre and post-game where I can get close to the action and shoot things close and personal while staying mobile and being able to run around and get the shots that I need. The biggest con with this setup would be the lack of range. You can't really shoot the game with this, but if you do, it's nice to get stuff in the end zone and kind of mix things up with your tighter shots. For the hi-hat setup, I have my second Blackmagic in a cage with a five inch focus monitor, a Rode mini shotgun mic, a one terabyte SSD, and a Canon 70 to 200 with an ND filter if needed. This is what I use to shoot in-game action. During the game, photographers and videographers are limited to sign light access, so I need something stable with range to capture the span of the field. The 70 to 200 covers a good amount of the field, and I love having my setup on a hi-hat because it gets my camera low to the ground for that low angle feel. On top of that, it's nice to not have to get tired from holding up a heavy camera on your shoulder or in your hands. It just sits on the ground next to me as I kneel over it. Pro tip, if you're gonna go with a setup like this where you're kneeling next to your camera, make sure to invest in some knee pads. The biggest con with this setup would be weight and lack of mobility. It's definitely a setup where I like to just take it to the end zone and just bunker down for the entire drive. So there it is, my camera setups for shooting NFL games. If you have any additional comments or questions, make sure to leave a comment below and make sure to like and subscribe. I'm so close to a thousand subscribers and I need your help to get there. So please subscribe if you haven't and I'll see y'all in the next one. Deuces. Still going bad on you anyway. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah! I can feel like 80 rats in my Mary. Me and Drizzy back to back is getting scary. If you tripping with my eyes, just don't come near me. Get out my way. Put some bins all on your head like Jesse Terry.